So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then this girl is lambing in here, right in the middle of the nettles. She's gonna hate me, because I'm gonna come in and, oh, it's a small little one. I'm gonna take it out of here, because it's not fair being surrounded by nettles when you have a baby fresh nose. And you're very mucky. Yeah, you good mama. She's a very nervy mama. There. My uh, Java, come on. There we go. Hopefully she only has the one, but it's so small she might have two. But if she has the, this is her first lamb. Hey, little bit. You showing me your tail because you're nearly ready to lamb. Is that what's going on? You nearly ready to have babies. I think you might be. And this lovely lady that was having her babies over there has had a second one. Oh. And there's a third one. Oh, blast. I missed this. Okay. It's still in its sack, but it's cold. It's dead. Sack. So she had triplets. So you had triplets. And this one's doing, come on, get up. Yeah. You're just a baby, come on. And you're a boy. Yeah. So that one was the first one. She was so tiny, I didn't think she had triplets in her. But, uh, that one was born in the sack, and I should have been here. I was looking after other sheep. Okay. Oh, bugger. You can go back to your new baby. That one's only just born. This is really sad. If I'd been here like I was with the uh, lamb last night, I could have taken the sacking off and it might have lived. Okay, I've got to bring this lamb over to the newer born one. You're stuck. Are you stuck? Here. I'm gonna put them here. There. There we go. Okay, you concentrate on those two. I'm gonna take this and put it in a bag. So sad. But that's farm life. I just wasn't there at the right moment. She's at least got two living lambs. Okay. This is the yo that had the triplets and one was dead. And that lamb is not doing well at all, so I'm going to tube it. And Susan's gonna film me tubing it. So here you go. Easy does it, girl. She's a very nervy sheep. very cold. The mouth is still warm, but the ears are really getting cold. And you can see it's got the shivers. So it got a little bit neglected when that other lamb was born, the one that was still in its uh, sack. 
Oh, you're shivery. This is lovely and warm. You're going to love this. I promise. I promise this is going to be delicious. It's going to warm you up beautifully. Okay. I let gravity, I let gravity take it down. I'm not one of those people who use the plunger to force it into its tiny baby belly. But this is going to warm it up. You see, it's all shivery. When this is finished going down, I'm gonna give it a good rub with the straw to dry it off. Come on, good boy. Yes, very cold. Also, as you probably know, when you're um, hungry and you eat something, you can get chilly because your energy all goes to the stomach to digest. The there food. is a baby right behind you, Susanna. So just oh, okay. <laughs> when you... Oh, hello. Yeah, we might have to take and bottle rear one of the lamb, the this triplet. The yo lamb is a bit of a runt, so we might have to have a bottle reared one. Okay. Okay. Now I think I've given you plenty. You can have a good full belly. No, this isn't yours. I promise you, this is not yours. No, this isn't yours. You don't want four. No, you definitely don't want four. This isn't yours. This isn't yours. <laughs> yours is right here. Look, there's yours. Okay, now move this out of the way. And give this good. Stimulates the lamb. Yes. Vigorous rubbing. And oh, come on. There we go. Oh, yes. Little tiny thing. You're a tiny thing. You're tiny. Uh, and look, it's already sitting upright. Sort of. Come on. Its ears already are not as cold as they were when I started, and it's not shivering as much. You can see it's definitely not shivering as much. You're still chilly. Almost starting to think of getting up. He's doing, he or she's doing little sucky things. He's, so well, he, the reflex is yeah. going. The mouth is still a little bit chilly. The ears are warming up. Oh, it's exhausting being born. Now 
out. If I put your legs under you, how does that do? <laughs> now these are the shakes, not because of cold. This is because we're balancing, we're finding our balance. Isn't that much better? We're finding our balance and we're not shivering. There, by putting your knees, legs under you. Come on, come on. Oh, it's awful hard work being born, isn't it? I'm gonna give you back to your mama. We're still, we've got a bit of a shiver there. But you've got a warm belly of food in you. So now I'm gonna return it to its mother and sister. Oh. There we go. Job done. And she's coming to help. Okay, bit. wait, I want to give her this at the front. Oh, there you go. Come on. Come on, baby. We go a little bit. Come on. Girl. Are you licking it? Yeah. Come here, babes. Stop retracting. Come on. Push. Push a little bit. I'm going to do something there. awful. Okay. I'm going to roll her over. Oh, okay. Go a little bit. Oh, there we go. Coming. Something. No. There we go. Come on, baby. Come on, little bit. Oh, hang in there a little bit. There's. Come on. little bit. Come on, help me a little bit. A little bit. Come on, help me. This one's got a big head. There we go. Push a little 
Push, push, girl. Oh, oh here gosh. we come. Oh, here we come. Oh, oh that's so Oh, my goodness, yes. Oh. Look at that big. This is a big boy. You're a big boy. Oh, well done, little bit. Oh, I got afterbirth all over my face. Oh, that's oh. Now, there are Janie Mac, those are a set of big twins. I, you better not have another one. Yeah. Oh. Those are huge. That ram lamb is ginormous, isn't it? He is big. Well done, little bit. Well done, little bit. What's, so this is the boy. The boy is a broken blaze, and this is, this is a girl. So she's got a girl and a boy. Now don't have any more. Yeah. You're only allowed no to have triplets. two. No more triplets. We don't want three, pair, three sets of triplets today. No. One day is too much. Exactly. Oh. Here I'm going to dry my. This is uh, called the shepherd's towel. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> left from 27 down to we're 27 down to six I love the motherly purr I love is the honesties coming up and look these uh, gems are coming up they look so beautiful with the uh, bluebells the colors are just fantastic look at those gems with the blues and greens woohoo I love those kind of color combinations there. Loads of honesty now coming up. And these tulips. Oh, the rich color there. Woohoo! There are times when one is very, feels very privileged to be able to garden and produce 
such beauty with the help of nature. Look at that. Oh, and look at that in there. And a bit of this. You can take that out. Oh, a little weeding. Loads of weeding. And look at the different foliages. Oh, I'm having such fun watching this border develop. It's hard work because there's lots of weeding. And want us to dig out this right there. That's a scrub plum. I don't want it growing in there. Look at those. These are big, tall snowflakes. And this is such a beautiful tulip. This is one of uh, last year or the year before's tulips. And the columbine is going to flower soon. These are the leaves of the columbine. How beautiful is that? And I just, I'm such a huge fan of honesty. I love honesty. I'm gonna have to tube this, the triplet. And this is the uh, yo lamb that, um, was born of the triplet. She's not getting enough milk because her brothers are bigger. So this might end up being a bottle reared lamb. So tubing again, this time in the great outdoors. babes a little bit more this will set you up to compete with your brothers yeah it'll set you up to compete with your brothers yeah no I'm nearly done there you go there's your baby now she's got a lovely full belly. There you go. A lovely full belly. So she can keep up with her brothers. <laughs> At triplets. Two boys and one girl. Yes. That's it. Yeah. brothers. What do you want? Hmm? <laughs> Surrounded by the triplets. I've set up a pen for them for this evening. I'm gonna put them inside because they are triplets. Uh, but I'm gonna let her graze outside to begin with. There's no rain, it's very, very mild. They've all had something to drink. And they're all keeping up with her. So we only have a few left. And then here's a little bit with her too. I 
I've treated, I've uh, done their navels. So that's her afterbirth coming out. It is not a third lamb. But you have two stonkers a little bit. Absolute huge pair of twins. I'm gonna go get her uh, some nuts that I'll just drop up here and I'll bring a bucket of water so she can have a drink of water and some sustaining food, give her strength.